Hello everyone, this is Ajahn Jimmy, and welcome back to Remnant 2, um, the Dark Horizon one-shot mode. We're having a great day today. We're here in the Logistics Bridge, and I think we just got here, and so we're going to check it out, see what's going on. Um, truth be told, I was kind of hoping to play um, on Apocalypse difficulty with my buddies, but I'm kind of just waiting for them right now, so I figured I'd, I'd jump in on my, uh, my main game playthrough, see what's going on here. Boys, ready? Let's see what's going on in the logistics. Okay, this is a familiar map to me. Um, can't remember the name of it. Somebody uh, in the comments before had told me that um, they reused the same maps. For each world, there's like three or four different uh, path patterns, which I never noticed before. It was told to me, you know. Here they come. It makes sense, though. It's you know, for the sake of efficiency. Oh, he's dead. There we go. I can do a full melee run with this. Oops. Ooh. There we go. Oh no, not yet. There we go now. One of my buddies said he was down, but the other one didn't reply it, so I'm, I'm thinking that he's just uh, uh, away from his keyboard at the moment, so... He will reply when he's ready, and then I'll join. Now, I don't know what the deal is with the logistics... ...thing, but I guess we're gonna find out. Ah, this looks like an injectable that I remember doing. This one here. Now, I don't think I actually successfully did this. We'll find out, though. Yeah, this is the one. I don't think I got it. Maybe I did get it later on. But Basically, there's a boss. And he's going to spawn in right about now. Thank you. Oh, not the drain cubes. He's killing my boys. Oof. He killed me! He actually killed me! I am fooling around too much. Oh, can I just can I just make the jump? No, I can't. <laughs> I most definitely can't. Alright. Good to know. Good to know. Ugh. Oh, I hate that I have to call these things down again, man. I understand it though, there's a reason for this. It's like you don't want it guessing, especially if you're in multiplayer, but you don't want it guessing where you're where you want it to be. Because I have actually done this in the past. I've accidentally used this to send a, a like a mini boss someplace else, that someplace that I was not, so that helped quite a bit with uh, fighting that enemy. I think it was actually in the One True King. Oh, near the end, he, um, oh, let me do this, you know, right before you get to the throne room, there's two of those sword mini bosses that spawns, 
Um, I think I was fighting this on Apocalypse. I was like helping, helping uh, randoms. And uh, yeah, like it, it was like kind of crazy because to have two of them on you, right? They're so, such a small margin of error. So I accidentally kited one into the elevator and then pushed, activated the elevator and left. It's pretty jokes. But yeah, that worked out very well for me. So now let's see. I think that these gates are all going to be closed up again. I could be wrong though. And they are. So the strat is just going to be that we call in the boss. And we run away. Run away, lads. Run away. Oof. Okay, let me just grab this. Okay. What? Oh shoot! Oh wait, wait, wait a minute! What's going on? These are the boys. <laughs> Why are the boys here? <laughs> okay, okay. We, we might we might call it here. It might be an extra short one. You, YouTube might not even see this. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, but anyways, let me uh, let me stop recording here and then I'll switch over because I I like talking to them. You know. So thanks for watching, everyone. See you when I see you. If you see this, if not, you'll never know.